What up, players? We're about to stay up in this mood. So here is my finished Chaos Nurgle Lord. I was planning on doing a war boss tutorial on him, but I ended up using a whole bunch of different techniques and trial and error. So what I might do is, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with the way this one turned out, so I might pick up another one. I don't know though, because if I don't really have a Nurgly themed Warriors of Chaos army, I don't know what the point is of getting a second one. But yeah, some of the techniques I wanted to try out ended up not working, so I'd had to switch mid paint job and by then I'd already filmed the first half of the the tutorial so I decided to just keep on going and just finish it off and kind of happy with it I took most of the techniques for the armor plates it's a little bit different than the than the white dwarf heavy metal version that you're gonna see on the site but it's actually from 2008 uh, white dwarf from the December of that year which had a master class on how to paint a chaos lord for Nurgle so I decided to try and copy the techniques taught in that master class article and see how it turned out for me and I'm pretty satisfied with it. I might go back again and do a little bit more with the washes though and a little bit more with the chipping and the weathering. But overall I'm pretty happy with this guy and especially with the the effect of the skin underneath and the purpling bruised rotted skin that's bursting open on the stomach or the effect of the rust on the axe and the just the weathering all over with the verdigris like on the helmet tried a different technique too with the horns where it's a little bit darker at the base and at the tip and gradually gets lighter at the center so I'm pretty happy with the way that turned out anyways thanks for watching hope you guys liked it let me know if you have any questions and uh, don't forget to like leave a comment subscribe favorite if you if you really like what the finished product turned out to look like and I will see you in the next one. I also have a sneak preview for what I'm going to be doing next. My next War Boss tutorial is going to be on this fella. A Kronos, or a Talos Paint Engine for the Dark Eldar range. And I built him up to make it look like he's floating, like he's strafing to the left. His his base is kind of angled like he's coming from that angle direction and his chain flail arm is modeled to look like he's floating in floating towards the left and gravity is making the snares at the bottom the hooks at the bottom flow behind the rest of the arm so man this model is fantastic and can't wait to paint him up so stay tuned for that but once again, this one is just to showcase my finished product for the Chaos Lord of Nurgle for the Warhammer Fantasy range. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you in the next one. Latest players!